And now a defendant learns his fate in the deadly shooting of a cyclist on the Rickenbacker Causeway. The jury found him guilty on two counts. The night team's Michael Hudak spoke to the jury foreman about their deliberations and joins us live from the courthouse in Miami now. Michael. That jury deliberating for less than four hours. And now, as you mentioned, their foreman telling 7 News what it was like inside of that room. We, the jury, find as follows. As to count one of the charge, the defendant is guilty of second-degree murder. The defendant is guilty of aggravated assault with a firearm. 46-year-old Cadell Piedrahita found guilty of second-degree murder and aggravated assault with a firearm. <laughs> After shooting and killing 48-year-old Alexis Palencia, on the Rickenbacker Causeway in 2019. The only expression on his face is murder. His seven day trial ending Monday, the jury deliberating for about three hours. There were two things that we had to look at. Mark Stone, the jury's foreman, speaking with Seven News after the verdict. Guilty of second degree murder. The first was whether there was, it could have been self defense. How do we know that Mr. Piedraita was attacked by multiple people? that one of those individuals became armed. In the end, we felt that there was no reasonable possibility that the victim had a gun or was pointing a gun. He says, Fajen ya, fight already. The defense arguing that Piedra Hita was in fear for his life, that either Palencia or one of the cyclists he was with had a gun. That gun was never found by police. So with no gun, that really left us to whether or not there is any other behavior on the part of the victim and others who are with the victim that really could have put the defendant in fear of his life. The two men routinely rode in the same cycling group to Key Biscayne <laughs> and had reportedly been locked in a long running feud. Specifics on their feud remains unclear. Stone describing how these videos of the seconds before the shooting played a major factor. Really the second part uh, was the standard for second degree murder was his state of mind. Did he show a depraved indifference to human life? And that's actually what we talked about. He really you know, didn't have to do what he did. Next, of course, is Piedra Hita's sentencing. When that sentencing will take place will be decided tomorrow, Tuesday, in court. We're live at the Metro Justice Building. Michael Hudak, 7 News Night Team.